Hey, hey, Brian Sensei here. In this video, we're going to look at audio settings in Windows 11. This is important when you need to adjust volume levels and select from various microphone and speaker devices. Let's dig in. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna look at is how to quickly adjust the volume level of the speakers on your computer. So here at the bottom right in the taskbar corner, you're gonna see a little speaker icon. If you left click here, you're gonna be able to adjust the volume of your speakers by sliding left or right. If you click on the speaker icon here, it will completely mute your speakers. And you'll notice when you adjust the volume level and let go, you'll hear an audio chime for feedback. Next to that, if you click the carrot, you're going to be able to select from the different speaker devices that may be connected to your computer. In this case, I have a Yeti stereo microphone, which has an audio input for a headphone. So if I wanted to use those headphones to listen, I would go ahead and select this one. And the one here on the bottom is my display audio. This refers to speakers that are built into my display monitor. As you know, some monitors have speakers built in. So I can make these selections to choose where I want to hear the computer sound. Now, notice down below this, you have more volume settings. Another way to get to this is to simply, instead of left-clicking on your speaker icon, you can right-click on it, and you can get these additional settings. One is the volume mixer, and the other is your sound settings. Let's go ahead and go into sound settings. And here our Windows settings will open up. And the first thing we have is choose where to play sound. So again, here's where we can select the speakers that we want to utilize to hear our computer sound. If you need to add a new device, you can go ahead and click add device here to set up a new speaker, or perhaps you want to pair some Bluetooth speakers or a Bluetooth headset with your computer. Below that, we have our volume adjustment. Uh, here's an option to combine left and right audio channels into one, so you can hear it as mono audio rather than something different on the right and something different on the left. Below that, we have our input. Now, this would be our microphone settings. So, in this case, I'm using my Yeti microphone, but I also have a Logitech webcam microphone. This is a microphone built into my webcam. And then I also have a split cam audio mixer, which is part of a split cam application. So again, I can make those selections to determine which microphone do I wanna use for audio input. Again, here you have the ability to pair a new device, such as a Bluetooth earpiece with a microphone on it. Here we have our recording input level. So this essentially you can adjust up and down by bringing it down. Any audio that you record is going to be quieter. All right, below that we have advanced settings. So if you need to troubleshoot devices, whether it's a speaker device or a microphone, you can go in and troubleshoot those. Here we have all sound devices that we can manage, such as turning them on and off, if you want to completely disable them. And then below that, we have our volume mixer. And so the nice thing about this is you can actually mix your levels. So let's go into this. And basically, we have two levels that we can adjust. The volume, the speaker volume here. And then down here, we have our system sounds. Now, system sounds relate to little notification chimes that come from the computer, such as when you connect a USB device, you'll hear a little chime. 
Uh, when you get a notification from an app on your computer, you'll also hear a little chime. Well, you can adjust how loud those notification sounds are. All right, and let's go back to our sound settings. And then if we jump into all sound devices here, let's take a look where we can even dig further into each and every device and work with the settings. So let's say, for example, that we wanted to work on the settings of our microphone. We'll go down here into our Yeti microphone, click into this, and here we could do things like don't allow this microphone to be used by apps. That would essentially disable it. Uh, we also have some input settings for recording, so we could adjust those settings here. Again, our input volume. And then here we can test out our microphone. We can start a test that will allow us to make sure it's working, but also uh, it will take us through a process of adjusting that input volume for us based on the test that we run. All right, those are the sound settings, both for speakers and microphones on your Windows 11 computer. I hope this video was helpful. Feel free to leave comments down below to let me know, and I'll see you on the next one.